Let's talk to Simon Calder, travel correspondent for The Independent. Good morning to you, Simon. Uh, good, morning, good morning, Julia. Thank you so much for joining us. Now, the interesting thing is, you know, you can either download on your phone a lot of... I mean, my, my parents are 79 and 80. They'd be able to download... Well, my mum could download on the phone. Dad, probably not. Um, but we've seen other couples say, well, actually, you know, I've downloaded on my phone and they've been told, no, they don't want that. They want me to reprint. And, but I'm in a hotel. I can't print out my boarding pass. And they face these sort of charges. Um, how reasonable is it for an airline to say, well, that's the cost. You knew that. It's not our fault. We are making that charge really interesting question so here's the um uh, what, what i'm sort of hearing from other people is as follows i put a, a a twitter survey out or x as i think we have to call them now and said do you think this was reasonable because they were warned about it or do you think that um uh, they should actually have been given some some a bit of discretion yeah. which I, i'm sure you would find in most other settings if you've got a 79 and an 80 year old obviously they're a bit confused you would think most people in who, who was working at a transport um, setting would say okay we'll give you the benefit of the doubt yeah. this didn't happen and of course Ryanair with a very very combative statement said look we tell everybody the rules if you don't want to follow them then you are going to be hit with a 55 pound charge to me that looks a bit more like an on the spot fine yeah. and actually on this survey um 65% we're talking nearly 9000 respondents here 65% said it was basically outrageous um 35% said them's the rules and uh, yeah i mean there is you that you, you do know what the rules are i tend to download these things onto the app i keep the app for all these airlines on my phone and i print out paper copies we just travel the five of us traveling right here's everyone's passports here's everyone's boarding passes but i've got the boarding passes on my phone as well just in case someone managed to you know to leave it in wh smith or boots in the airport but this thing it's about having discretion but again a lot of these stuff they don't they're not allowed to operate discretion they 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 they're told no you you can't use it you can't do this unless you take a charge for it uh, that is exactly right. I've spoken to a number of um, people who've worked for Ryanair ground services and very often they are actually working for other companies mm. and Ryanair just take a complete no prisoners rules. Yeah. These are the rules. You know, somebody turns up with their boarding pass, um, they can get on board. By the way, Julia, I hope everybody is taking notes of your very good practice, which is to have them printed out, <laughs> have them on your phone, a belt and braces every single time. Um, and, and Ryanair simply says, look, uh, effectively, I can imagine the discussion in the office in their headquarters in Dublin. Right, if we're nice to Mr and Mrs Jaff, who clearly, you know, this is an absolutely honest mistake, yeah. where does it stop? Yeah. Um, does it, you know, a slightly forgetful, dare I say it, radio presenter, um, not, not you, of course, maybe one of your colleagues turns up and they haven't um, done what you've done. Do we let them off? Uh, where does it end? Yeah. And so they just say, we're going to enforce this. That's the the story i think the crucial issue here and i think we might be hearing a bit more about this is whether 55 pounds is just off yeah the scale i mean because let's much. face it a tenner would be enough to, to you know to deter people i wouldn't go oh i won't bother i'll just pay a tenner for each of us to print our boarding passes at the airport so that would be enough it is it is punitive but my god it focuses the mind doesn't it simon called a travel correspondent independent i'm sure has never had to do this